Hey, this is a quick video about links and how to write file paths between them. So as we talked about, links in HTML are written through a tags. So it's a tag, href, you give the file path dot HTML to the HTML file you want to give, um, whatever you want to show up on the page show up linked on the page is between the a tags and then you have your closing a tag. Trick is with file paths, how you write them. So there's a couple different options, different ways this can go. Let's picture file paths as big folders. So we have our big folder here, then we have a subfolder here, then we have another subfolder. Let's say this is our, this big folder is our web design folder. This folder is, let's call it um, unit one folder. And then let's say in our unit one folder, we have a um, subfolder with, uh, maybe if it's your bio web page, this is like the um, other web pages or the other, I don't know, other web pages you've made. Other pages, we'll call this one. So if I have a web page here called first web page, the HTML, and I want to get to um, second web page, the HTML. So this is where I start, and I want to get to here. Where's my little thing? There we go. If I want to get there, my file path is going to be, my href is going to be second web page. So my code is going to look like a href and then I'm just going to literally put the file name second web page that HTML because it's in the same folder. So my file path is as simple as that. If I had a web page up here start.html and I wanted to go from my first web page to the start HTML page. I can't, ugh, no, come back. There we go. I can't, I can't make my, my, my web link like this, right? Because it's not in the same folder. If I look for start HTML, it's just gonna look in here. So I have to tell it to go up a folder into my web design folder and look for start HTML. How that's written is A, and then the, your file path, your href, is going to be dot dot dash. That means go up a folder, start.html. So this is for the green one. If you need to go up, you always do dot dot dash, and then whatever the file name is. So dot dot dash puts you up a folder. And then you look for start.html, which is right here. But let's say I want to get to, um, we'll call this lower web page. A web page that's below, again, I'm starting at first web page, a web page that's below in another subfolder. The subfolder is called other pages. If I wanted to go to there, from the first page, I would have to tell my file path to first go into the lower folder. So go into the other pages folder, slash, then look for the lower web page.html. So my file path is I have to tell it to look for the folder, other pages go into that folder and then look for the other web pages. So those are the three options. 
you can either be looking for something in the same folder, and if it is that, it's just the file name, in the folder above, if it's in the folder above, you do dot dot dash, then the file name, or in a folder below. The folder below is here, then it would be lower web page. So when you're linking your stuff, make sure you're thinking about, okay, if my web page is in unit three, if it's in the web design folder, it's one folder up, right? If it's in the demo folder, it's one folder down. If it's in unit three, same thing. I would say play around with the file paths and see what works. Um, that you gotta think about where they are all together. If, it, if they're in the same folder, if they're in folders going up or folders going down. All right, I hope that helped.